Today we are going to paint and live in the flowers with these Q-tips which I've already closed with the rubber band and we are going to use single paint brush to make the steps and these are the colors which we are using to make flowers dark purple, light violet, white for some highlights, green, light green and dark green or light and darker shade in the steps. First, we are going to make some stems. You can take any picture, right? You can keep any picture right in front of you and you can just draw that picture. It's not for me to say you. Mixing some dark color in the stem. It's not for me to say you love. If you take half green, light green and half dark green on the brush, it will give you two color impact. Light and dark. Try to use two different color on the tip. Now I'm using these Q-tips. First, I'm going for darker color. Try to smudge first in the plate, then see. You don't need to put any detail. Just these Q-tips will give you the impression. Right now we are using only darker color. When we are done with darker color, we can move to the lighter tone. Now you can see light and dark tone, both tones. Without adding any, if you have white color, you can add white and purple, dark purple, purple to make it lighter. Now I'm going to add a little white to give it the third tone, the lighter tone. I feel I need to add some highlights in the leaves, so that's why I'm going to add a little yellow see this one is ready I made another one so you can look at this you can use this method to paint different flowers, different cards for your friend, for your family because it's a spring season. So everyone wants to see pretty flowers outside, inside the house. So you can paint and with two, two or three simple things at home. Thank you. Bye.